crushed it. I'm a better singer and boater than Pocahontas will ever be. Am I right? What do you mean we're recording? Get this off. How do you turn this thing off? <laughs> hey, everyone. And welcome to the greatest activity area at Camp Andesong. Y'all ready for this? That's right, it's boating. Boats and paddles and lakes, oh my. So last year, we taught you all about the basics, like the paddles and all the strokes and all that good stuff. Pfft, child's play. But this year, we thought we'd take it up a notch. So, I give you, drum roll please, kayaking, an inside look at boating with your buddy. Ooh, ah. So in case you didn't already know, our kayaks at Camp Anasong seat not one, but two people. Super duper awesome. So that being said, I'm going to need a little bit of help from a special guest. He's awesome. He's a boating expert. He's from Idaho. Seriously though, he's like potato extraordinaire. None other than. Chase Halgerson. No, I'm not going to do the dishes. I did them yesterday. Yeah, big deal. Oh, sorry there. Oh, yeah. So what's up? My name is Chase, and yeah, what's going on? So, according to the anatomy of a kayak, there are two seats, one in the back and one in the front. I'm feeling extra perky today, so I'm going to take the back, and Chase is going to handle the front of the boat. Let's head down and get in the water. To the lake. Away! Shazam! This is awesome! The back of the boat rocks. You're in charge of super important things, like turning and steering the kayak. Hey Chase, I'm going to turn us left now. Well, all right. Now we're out boating, so I am here in the front of the boat, and yes, I am using an electric guitar as a paddle. Don't question my lifestyle. So yeah, when you're in the front of the boat, the most important thing you want to know is that you're going to have to use communication out there, because if you don't communicate with the person in the back of the boat, you will have a bad time. Not going to lie, it really feels like I'm doing a lot of the paddling out here. Come on! Go! Yo, girl! I'm not gonna lie, this is just the most tubular in the worst kind of way. What? Done! Never mind, don't feel like doing that either. Dunzo! And there you have it, friends, an inside look at boating with your buddies, the kayak edition. Oh, I just feel so refreshed. As you've probably come to realize by this point, boating is the best. It's the next big thing. Next, let's have a look at Hollywood's biggest stars and their thoughts on boating. What's up, everybody? It's Justin Bieber. What do I like about boating? <laughs> That's easy. Gives me a chance to get away and have some peace and quiet from all the ladies. The water's also a great place to find some inspiration for a new song. Girl, your eyes sparkle like the lake, or an ocean, or another body of water. Hey guys, it's Taylor Swift. Yeah, I definitely agree with Justin. I would have to say I like to come out on a boat and just write some songs, especially after I break up with a boyfriend. So yeah, I'd say I go boating about every two weeks. We are never, ever, ever going boating together. We like ever. Trouble when you paddled in. 
Hello, I'm Edward Cullen. I like to go boating alone because it's one of the only places I can be myself in the sunlight. Ah, that's more like it. Take it from our friends in Hollywood, guys. Boating rocks. So get out there, grab a paddle, grab a life jacket, and hit the water.